Hi all. Welcome um, back to my YouTube channel on AG Grid and Angular. So, in the previous videos, we have discussed about what AG Grid is, its installation, and its key features and advantages. So today we will be discussing on its one of the major features that is sorting and filtering. By default, the AG Grid by default, if we are not setting any properties for sorting and filtering, it won't allow sorting or filtering in AG Grid. So to have sorting or filtering, we need to set certain properties to true. So we will see what all uh, are those properties and what all are the configuration that we need to have sorting and filtering in our AG Grid. So let's start. So, we can set some certain default column definitions for AG Grid. By setting the, uh, those definitions, it will be applicable for each and every columns of that particular table or grid. So, what we will do is, we will declare a property called default column def. And we will be having two properties. One is the sortable property and the filter property to true. We'll set those properties to true. By setting sortable property to true, what it will do is it enables sorting for all columns. And by setting filter to true, will enable filtering in all columns. And then after that, in the HTML, we will be setting the default column definition. That's a directive in AG Grid. And we'll be setting to our private property variable or property okay so by doing so what happens is for each column we will have the sorting option and the filtering option so remember the sortable property and uh, by setting it to true it will enable sorting and the filter property setting to true will enable filtering so let's see in our real time so in Visual Studio, now uh, in our application, if we see, we don't have the sorting or filtering. To have sorting, we need, we are going to change our code. Okay, so this is the HTML. In the TS, what we'll do is we will create a new private definition, private default column definition property. And in the constructor, now we are setting this default column definition sortable property to be true. So let's check how it works. Okay. So before that we need to add this as well in the HTML. This is a directive. So what we'll do, we will add it here. Okay. On save. So I think there is some mistake here. Let me see. So there was some codes issue here. So on changing that in the HTML by correcting that, now if we see the sorting is enabled. So here we can sort it in the ascending or descending order, the price value. We can sort the model on alphabetic order in ascending or descending value. Similarly, also the make. Here we can see the oh, by setting the default value, uh, default column definition, sortable property to true, all the fields or the, all the columns in the table have the sorting enabled. Similarly, we can check for the filter as well. So, in the definition, default column definition, I am setting the filter property to true. Okay. 
and on saving what we can see is we have a new icon over here on clicking that we can filter see it will filter the rows whose price contains 35 if I give 32 it will filter accordingly so similarly for model also we have filters see it is filtering as we enter the data see similarly it has for make as well if we type to it will filter the row groups that contains the word to so this is filtering so we have both sorting and filtering for all columns in this AG grid so by setting the default property we apply the all the properties to the entire table entire columns of the table so now if we have a scenario where we need only sorting or filtering to a particular column then what we will do is it possible yes is it is possible so if we need to set the sorting and filtering only to the price column here then what we need to do is like we need to set the default column definition that sorting property and filter property to false and in the column definition of price we need to have to make them true that is in the price column definition we need to set the sortable property and the filter property to be true and in the default column definition it should be false so let's try that so in the component.ts we are setting the default sortable property to false okay similarly we are setting the filter property also false and on save if we check again we can see that now there is no sorting and filtering available for any of the columns our requirement is like we need the sorting and filtering only to price so what we can do we can set in the column definition of price that is here we are setting this to true the sortable property to true and on save we can see here the price column the sorting is in the price column the sorting is enabled now we can sort in descending or ascending order but for model and make there is no sorting available similarly if we set filter to true and if we click save after the compilation if we reload the page we can see the filtering is there for the price column let let us check for the model do we have the filter no we don't have the filter so in this video what ha we have learned is to set the sorting and filtering to the entire AG grid and also we can set the sorting and filtering property to a particular column so what if we need for model as well if we need only filtering to be applied on model then what we can do is we can copy and paste this in the column definition for model as well so by doing so the model column have filtering enabled but no sorting since we have not set sorting so here we have the filtering see now it is getting filtered to Porsche Boxster where because we have search for BO test in the model so it's filtering accordingly hope this is very helpful for you so we have discussed on sorting and filtering if you like the video 
please comment uh, comment like subscribe and share thank you